Hey guys, okay, listen, things are a bit chaotic over here. We woke up this morning and it was angry. No one in this house is okay. Enhanced by stress relieving eucalyptus. What about that? Just stop talking. Okay, we'll just crash that and I'll call you. We're home! You're vlog i'm jenica i'm annika yeah we're still in gallenberg all right i know that last vlog job. that we said that we were wrapped up there but we have passed this so many. every it's right down from our resort we stayed at the dollywood dream War resort and it's right down the road from it it is the rocky That's mountain rocky, rocky top, top mountain oh, coaster. coaster we've wanted to do a mountain coaster we did the one at alpine village but this one's like a this one's a mountain like, that one was a feature at that park this one this is, one the, is park. the thing so i think we can ride together which is good i for think the program. we can which is great for the program because we only have one go and y'all know that i'm the passenger princess and I'd love you to sit back and enjoy. We didn't even have a discussion over who was going to be driving. I just looked in the car and she was in the passenger seat. Oh, well, I mean, oh, obviously I can drive if you want. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say something like earlier to make you feel bad, but I didn't. That's how to have a teenager, they said. I don't think anybody actually said that. I don't know. <laughs> Never in existence. Okay, we are so excited about this for real, so let's get going so then we can actually get on get the road, road and head home. <laughs> Relax. Yeah. I got the good seat. Okay. Okay. This is still conveyor out right there. Yeah. Yeah. Before we get going real crazy. I mean, we're going up the mountain. Oh, I'm calling for her back support. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh. 
really and we were just catching up before she leaves and now she's leaving love ya bye love ya. No, i'll keep up with you and i'll see you at home before we head home i'm actually going to stop at a local coffee shop i just need a little caffeine before i take my two hour trek and it's gonna make me feel so much better if i can get the hotel wi-fi was like not working for us so i'm behind a little bit and i just would like to get a little bit more organized like if i drive for two hours and i just have like work and organization and stuff on my mind i need to get stuff turned in and regardless we get coffee, we get work done, we get a break before we drive. So we are at, I think it's called Burlap, maybe? Cute little coffee shop. In Yelp we trust, so let's try it out. Embarrassing and for no what I mean the, nobody knows this well not y'all do because I'm telling you but it's so embarrassing Unpacking your suitcase of things that you didn't wear like there was just no circumstance I needed these at all, but you know I brought them just in case but it's embarrassing also I've used this for like towels and things sometimes But this time I packed clothes like the jeans and things that were bigger and it was perfect and it literally like doesn't take up any space because it's just it lays flat on top it has to lay in there anyway so i really need to start utilizing this little compartment more look at the cute new magnets aj came home with you know she has the Breaker box, is that what it's called I think? In her room and we're gonna have one obviously wherever we are in our house. So we tried to get magnets everywhere we go. How cute is this one for the pink Jeeps that we did? And then look how cute this Dollywood one is. It goes back and forth. How cute, it's the train that we took. Her name is Cinderella. <laughs> and then she also got a sticker for her laptop. Here's my, oh how cute. Wait, I gotta show you guys AJ's that she has. That she got last time. Hers is in her bathroom right here. Look how cute. Both of our little kitties, but I'm gonna put mine in my bathroom. However, I did have to show you guys how the cats react to these toys. It's it's genuinely so crazy. Let me get Weasley over here. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Okay, I'm not even gonna open this. I'm just gonna put it down and watch him try to get into it. I know he's gonna do it because he's already... Weasley, please open this. Please. <laughs> no, he's holding it. <laughs> we 
seriously, I'll get it for you. <laughs> Give me a second, hold on. This is actually for Mertzi. This is actually for Mertzi. Now you want what's in here. This is what you're smelling. Here, look, Weasley. Weasley, look what your mama got you. Look what this is what you're smelling. <laughs> no, this is it. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Y'all, this is hilarious. Oh, he loves it. I'm telling y'all, Annika was like, we have to get them more toys from this place because this is from the cat house we went to in Gatlinburg. She was like, we have to get them more toys. Weasley went crazy over him and look at him. I wish I could remember where he said that the catnip was from. It's like a special catnip. Oh <laughs> Mercy, we got you one too. We got you one too. What do you think? Oh, oh. Come on, James. We got you a treat, too. Come here. She also got this little pin she's going to put on her tote. I love having these things in my little keepsakes box. And then look how fun this is. We are going to plant these wildflowers on the balcony this year. Okay, I'm gonna go walk tunes and then take a shower. I finished the okay y'all know I'm a Freddie McFadden girly I am there was a book that I was like putting off reading for some reason like I always read the descriptions and I have the ones I want to read in my wish list so that I can just go in there grab one and move on and I kept coming up on this one it's called The Housemaid and I was like is it about somebody in the attic like that don't sound like sometimes I can't read stuff that's too intense you know so I have been putting it off and I just don't even know why 
I finally read it because also it's a series and I was like, I can't miss out on a Freedom and Skyden series. So just finished it on my last little trek home and immediately started book two. So The Housemaid, it's, it's a three part series. The next one is The Housemaid's Secret. So that is that on that. I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I forget that Chattanooga is really not that bad of a drive from here. No, we did. I didn't technically drive, I guess, the first half. But Chattanooga is not a terrible drive. Chattanooga is on our Tennessee to-do list. So stay tuned for a Chattanooga weekend from us. But if you think for one second, I'm getting those clean sheets with this body. No, no, oh no, y'all, I'm actually so excited to talk to you about today's sponsor because it is something that I genuinely use every single time I shower. AJ and I discovered them a couple years ago and we genuinely have just kept them in the rotation. Not only are we romanticizers over here, but these really do like improve my showering experience. Exactly, it says clear your mind and steam away congestion with a refreshing spa shower enhanced by stress relieving eucalyptus. What about that? Absolutely. Now, I have only tried the eucalyptus scent. However, look what they freaking sent me. They're doing a Mother's Day sale. This is the collector's box. You see, gorgeous, 30. There's 30 tablets in here and 10 different scents. We've got eucalyptus mist, citrus scrub. I think citrus scrub might be what we go with tonight. I'm just such a citrus orange. Like that's my favorite smell. Chamomile before bed though. What do you think? I wish we could vote. I feel like citrus is like a, maybe a morning shower. And there's only three, so maybe let's do like a, a good, I don't like love lavender. Sometimes like fresh lavender is a little bit too intense for me. So maybe I'll save la an Annika lavender. I mean, I like lavender. I like, I have, a, I have dry lavender in my shower right now. Milk and honey. I feel like I might need to do, or should I just stay with my plastic? I love this one. I have no, no, you know what? I think I am, I'm sorry. <laughs> The only one that I actually have tried, I've genuinely, I've not tried any other scents besides this one, but you know, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. These help me genuinely like look forward to a shower, an ADHD girly. Sometimes it can feel like a task. These make me look forward to it. This makes me romanticize it. It just puts you in like a tranquil spa like setting in your own home. They are made with all natural ingredients and no harmful ingredients and they last so long. So you don't put them directly, I'll show you guys when we put them in the shower. You don't put them directly under the main strain, kind of put them off to the side and it just lasts the entire shower. And I don't, it lasts my entire iPad shower. Y'all know I have a setup. Another thing that helps me enjoy showers more is this Kitsch towel scrunchie. This towel scrunchie truly is a game changer because I have so much hair and I wash my hair first. I feel like I like, drips down and then I need to wash my body. So after I wash my hair and after I really condition it, then I'm able to go ahead and pull it up in this. This starts pulling all of that additional moisture out. And by the time I get out of the shower, after I wash my body and stuff, this is like drenching wet and this isn't as hard to get to a detangling point. So love this guy. I just hang it right here. Okay, so they come individually packed. You just pop them open. Here she is. You immediately start smelling it. You. Oh my God, oh my God. Before we take things to the next step and I start stripping down, okay? Let me go ahead and get the code. You can relax and refresh with these Body Restore shower steamers. Check out the link in my description box and use code JENNICA20 to get 20% off of this gorgeous, perfect Mother's Day present collector's box. All right, let's take it to the next step. Now, this is the biggest indicator that I'm making that I don't have rings on. This is always going to say, also, by the way, this is from my dad for Christmas this year. How gorgeous is she? It's from Electric Picks. Yes, Electric Picks, and it's my birthstone, which also happens to be like one of my favorite, one of my favorite stone colors and favorite colors, red. Oh, I love it. It's so gorgeous, and it like hits a great spot. Anyway, okay, let's go. Okay, first. Obviously, we turn the water on. I do let it kind of go ahead and get warm before I place the shower steamer in. All right, we've got some condensation happening. The back corner is my fave. I guess I could really do it. Oh, I guess I could also do it up there. But this back corner is always my 
personal choice. about 25 minutes and I know that because I was 25 minutes into my law and order episode look at this 25 minutes 25 minutes and we still have still plenty now normally when it gets down to this I will just crank her up and stand there and just and then in about five minutes we've wrapped it up but this time I was like you know what I will show them that literally I was in there for 25 minutes and we still have some going still have some also let's look at my hair this thing's drenched I wish y'all could feel how wet this was. Sopping. But, for real, so serious. My hair's not like sopping and dripping out. This is directly from the shower and normally it would be literally if I wasn't, you know, in the towel or something. And now it's ready to brush and I'm not gonna blow dry it tonight. Sue me, I'm going to bed with wet hair. Okay! Annika's back, it's been a few days. It's been a few days, Annika's back. We've had a lot going on. We're going to the Just pool. Just to tell you some things. We're going to the pool because it's, it's, what is it in our? Oh, in the house currently right now it's 77 degrees. When we woke up this morning it was 80. No one in this house is okay. The, 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 the mommastat hat or the whatever has a button that says hold, hold that I don't yeah, know what, what it is. is what? Never pressed it before. Oh, it is right where Weasley, like we have suitcases over there to go down. So like it, it's level with Weasley. I'm not blaming Weasley. Yeah, we best not. Okay, <laughs> but something has happened to something happened to our air. So we're slowly make it's slowly making its way back down. But we have been trying. I've been trying on more. I've been trying to work in here, and I said if it's gonna be this hot inside, it's we might as well outside. be getting some freaking it's vitamin D. So we are all packed up. I have a hair appointment. We're gonna go to this afternoon as well, and then she's leaving us again. But. Sayonara. No worries. We have a lunch made. I made some. She had a rotisserie chicken from Costco, and I made some chicken salad. I had chicken salad. Didn't chicken have a lid, so <coughs> this is the lid, the bread. I became obsessed. Yeah, we've got some uncrustables, and some we're ready crackers, to go. Some pickles, basically everything. <laughs> What do you want to do? I mean, we act like we're not going to face down. And also, my reactions are never good, so, so we shouldn't plan for it. We shouldn't plan for okay, it. Okay, we'll just scratch that and I'll call you. Hey guys, okay, listen, things are a bit chaotic over here. What did I not? There's a full band. <laughs> There's a full band playing outside. I don't know what's going on. We have like a community center situation and there is a full, I mean, I'm gonna have to take, we're gonna have to go on a walk and see, Tina, we're gonna have to go on a walk and see what's going on out there. Do you hear that whole banjo going on? What is it? We're gonna have to go see. Anyway, we are home. Ah, you can't see my hair. Ignore the mic in my boobs because there's a banjo. It was either you here or you there with the banjo and all. Okay, listen, look how gorgeous my hair is. That's why I'm feeling myself. Can't you tell? This is how girls act when they get their hair done. Nails also this way sometimes too. And my nails look great right now too. Did on myself. Woo. Look at this hair though. Okay, so I like down here was still left over. I used to just box semi, -perm not permanent dye, but I used to box dye my hair just black once a year. And I stopped doing that in like 2019, I think. And I didn't dye it for a while. It was just getting glossed. After that black kind of faded out, well, I thought it had faded out, but you could definitely tell that there was like a darker contrast to this part of my hair. So my stylist Zach lightened this, pulled, I don't know all the stylist terminology, science of it all. I could literally never, but he was able to pull all of that black out and I have the most gorgeous, rich brunette summer gloss. It's perfect. It's perfect. It's perfect. I told him when I went, I wanted it lighter, like the lightest brown I could be, the lightest brunette I could be. Usually I try to go more like black brown or really dark. And then when I lighten it up, I'll just keep it like as natural as possible and put highlights and stuff in it. But I've never done something like this before and I'm obsessed. I think it looks so good. And I just look like a gal ready for the summer. You guys, I received a very fun DM yesterday, yesterday saying, hey, we sent a little PR package your way. You guys, chapstick. Look what we have! Oh my gosh, you guys. It is a collab for Mother's Day. And so they said they wanted to send it over. How sweet is that? Oh, there's a note. 
Oh, you know the card's gonna be beautiful. Let's see. Stop, I literally only have three stickers on my new computer and one of them is a flower truck. How cute. Aww. Oh my gosh, this is so nice. Thank you so much, you guys. Okay, so they did a collab with Modern Picnic. Oh my god, you guys. Uh, okay. Stop. Is this so for real? This is a little picnic basket? It's insulated. Oh my gosh, y'all look at this. Look at this. This is chic. This is chic city. Please tell me, y'all see, me getting on the subway headed to Central Park with my picnic. Oh my gosh, and it has a long strap too. This is iconic. Thank you so much. Oh, wait. They've also included some cards. How fun. They said to send to moms in my life. I'm gonna, these are so cute. These are incredible. Thank you so, so much. I mean, we have to go to Centennial Park immediately. We picked these up at Costco yesterday and I'm very excited to try them. We wanted to leave with some sort of dumplings and I have realized that gyoza, please let me know if I'm saying that right, is my favorite style dumpling. I love it. So, we've got a big, oh, we like these. These are pork and chicken. Okay, there's five of these packages. So, I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll only eat five. I wish I could remember the price. I think it was, I think it might have been 11, 14? No, surely not. Wait, I think I have to see. 14.99, did I say 11 or 14? 14.99. Okay, so technically 15. 15 bucks is pretty, pretty good here. Especially in this economy. Okay, so dump, I think the reason we like dumplings so much is because they're so easy to make with this Our Place pan. We just put this little guy in the bottom and it comes with this tray. We put the dumplings in there. Well, we fill it with water first. Put the dumplings in there and then steam them and they're so good. With these though, I'll probably pan fry them after I steam them a little bit. choice tonight. I love the watermelon lime flavor. It's so good. It's from Culture Pop. You know I love a probiotic soda and this one is very summertime to me. The last few days I do want to update you on what we were doing. In the meantime, I am working with Burt's Bees on TikTok and Instagram. So in this job we have to cross promote. So whether we want to be doing vertical content or not, it has to be done. And so I'm really trying to care as much about our vertical content as I do YouTube. I mean this is always my home. Like I'm, I'm always, if I could choose one it would be you. But I do have to step my vertical game up and I was able to do that this week with my Burt's Bees ads. So I just took yesterday off and completely focused on those ads, got those done. It, y'all, I had to get them to 90 seconds because Instagram still is only 90 second videos. I had 19 minutes of footage for one and 14 minutes of footage for the other. And I had to cut it down to 90 seconds. Just stop talking, you know? The, the answer is there and it is just a real it in, Jenica. So, I was like, I'll probably have like six minutes of footage and I uploaded and it said 19 and I said, maybe I don't need to say anything. So, I had, I was completely consumed by that. Maybe as I get better about it, I'll start <laughs> bringing you guys along. But I really had to just zone in on the vertical. But if you do follow me on Instagram or TikTok, maybe go like those. Ooh, go like them, maybe give it a comment because those, really does help so much when there is engagement on branded content. I will say the one that I did on the hike, I did two and a, a two and a half mile hike while carrying around a tripod and sitting it up and, and talking every so often. Y'all, I had to, I brought a little compact with me because I was like, I know that in some like trails I wanna, the litter, of course. I know in some parts of the trail, like I wanna just like blot my nose before going on camera again. Thank goodness I brought that with me because it was literally 80 degrees outside yesterday and I was like trying to play freaking Clint Eastwood in the woods with myself, directing, filming, capturing the sad. I had a really good time doing it. I loved it. It came out great. By the end of it, and I had Luna with me, I was, I came down the hill like, 
<laughs> the litter box we have is the litter robot, okay? And it self times and then rotates and the poop drops in the drawer for me. And sometimes you can just hear them banging around. Um, yum. These turned out, they look good. Let's try them. We're hoping to at least like them since we have so many. But if we don't, maybe Annika will, so maybe it's not the end of the world. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's great. Well, if you like gyoza, I'm not gonna be confident until y'all tell me. Then this is the move. Mm. It came with a little packet of sauce. It was small. And so I just used it for these when I was pan searing them. And I don't know what it, it's, this is good. Mm. Also. Boy in a box. Those were so good. So good. I should have made more. <laughs>